the fear is, dear God, let him be okay. It's let my child be okay after all is said and done. A mother speaking out for the first time since this frantic 911 call. Jennifer Marrow stepping back into that local New Jersey park to take us through what happened. It was a Thursday. It was 1030. I can remember it and we'll remember it forever. She says she was playing catch with her rambunctious two year old son Henry last month when he disappeared in an instant. I just know that he was there and then he was gone. Ma'am, give me an address. Ma'am, what's going on? My son fell in an open pool. Her son falling into two feet of moving water below. When I couldn't see his face anymore, I got in and crawled down the pipe um, till I couldn't see, but then his head went under and I couldn't see him. So I had to pop back up and turn on my flashlight and when I got him, I lifted him up and pushed him over the edge and like rolled him. We're on the tennis courts. The child is out. He's conscious and alert. Those moments after captured on this body camera video by New Jersey fire units arriving on the scene. She jumped in to get him. There was no other option. There was no other choice. There was no waiting. Um, I think any mother wouldn't have waited. Mom and son are doing okay. Officials say flooding from Hurricane Ida may have generated so much pressure in the underlying sewer that it caused the manhole cover to blow off. Officials say they have checked the area, local parks, to make sure every manhole is covered so that this does not happen again. In Union, New Jersey, Stephanie Ramos, ABC News.